exclusive interview with a woman attacked and robbed, and Houston police are showing us new surveillance video of the horrific incident. And she was picked up, body slammed to the ground. Zach Tautari joining us from the Texas Medical Center tonight, where that woman is being treated for life-changing injuries. Zach? I spoke to that woman, a mother of three from Vietnam. First of all, why do you just body slam her like that? Like, that is not, that's not really what you do. Like, that's not, like, why are you attacking females? Like, what's going on here? Like, the, the, the world is getting just crazy. This is why I need to be around your brothers and fathers and other males more. Just to, first of all, yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all gotta teach them not to act like this. And, and dads, y'all gotta definitely teach niggas not to act like this because this is ridiculous. Y'all just doing anything. Like, like this is this is full-blown craziness. Like, too much now she she got life-changing injuries? Come on, dog. That was not worth it. What, you took a cell phone? She was hurt so bad during the robbery, she can't walk. It's gut-wrenching watching walk. this video of 44-year-old Nung Trung who tells me through her kids she was beaten so badly she still can't feel her left leg nearly a month later. The surveillance from Houston police shows a suspect walk right up to Trung and wrestle her for her purse. After he her grabs purse? it, you can see Trung pick up the money envelope. That's when the robber grabs her again and slams her to the ground, grabs the money, then runs away. It fell over, over everywhere, and he, he kind of like wanted to run away, but came back and assault her. Police say this. Come on, man. What, what are you doing? Like, you're, didn't you already pick up the money in the envelope? Why are you going back to body slam her? Like, what did you get from the second slam? Suspect likely followed well, she Nung for 24 time. miles after she withdrew about $4,000 from a bank in southeast Houston. Then she drove to a business on Bel Air Boulevard to pay for tickets to visit relatives in Vietnam. In the video, you can see their passports scatter during the robbery. It's not a big loss of the money, but the big loss is her leg. A month after the incident, Trung is confined to a wheelchair. She can't go to the bathroom on her own, and she's in rehab, hoping to walk again. That's yes. That's excellent. I just need to practice trying to walk and stuff. With her family by her side, she's asking she for the public's help that. in she catching the person that. who did this. I'm very sad that this happened to me, and I just want to let people know to be careful. There is... That's that lame shit niggas should never, ever support. Like, that is weirdo. Like, bro, you done hurt a lady. I don't care about none of that. Like, first of all, that is not the person you should be going after. You're supposed to be going after other people that's, like, you feel me? Like, in the trenches, you feel me? Like, that's, you, you're going after that Asian old lady. Like, what are you, and you hurt her at that. If you didn't hurt her, it would be a little different. But, well, way different, you feel me? You hurt, you can't walk properly no more. It's over for you, dog. It's like, we don't want to hear what the fuck you got to We see you went back to hurt her. It's not like you, you didn't get what you wanted the first time. Like, you just violated for no, well, you wanted to brag. That's the reason, but it's not worth it. It's not worth it. And they about to probably try to violate you. Because you're just attacking freaking old Asian woman, like. But she's not that old. She's in her mid forties. But still, still. Damn, this is what our people come into. Not our people, because that's not my people. My people don't do stuff like that. But this is what people are coming to. Robbing old people and hurting them, breaking their leg. Come on, dog. We gotta do better as a whole. We need more jobs, opportunities for. The youth out here, because this, this is in programs and sports and, and other stuff, because they, they're just bored. They don't even know what to do. They think that's okay, listening to too much NBA Youngboy or, or somebody else. You feel me? Chicago music or something like that. Or,